to Fabulous Life, this is Fabio. Um, today I will introduce you a video of description of the MacBook Pro 16 inches. Uh, I just received uh, my uh, MacBook Pro a couple of days ago and I'd like to show you how it looks and the features and so on. I've also ordered this uh, MacBook Pro with uh, some specific specs and uh, I think that this video can be useful for the people that uh, maybe are considering to buy a Mac or maybe they just don't know yet if to buy a Mac or another machine so um, in this case I think it will be useful to see uh, how it looks like uh, what are the features and so on so uh, please uh, if you are interested follow this video watch it I hope you like it thank you very much just received my MacBook Pro and once you remove from the box from the courier this is the first thing that you will get out of the box it's a beautiful box from Apple uh, which contains the computer. The computer arrives uh, together with, you will see in a moment, with the charger and the cable for the charger and if you do not order any additional thing, that's the way you get it. But in my case, I'll show you, I have ordered also a protection for the computer. So, the computer is beautiful and it's here and this green case that you see is the protection for the computer. Now, the reason why I'm not doing this from scratch is because this is not really an unboxing video. I want this video to be of help for the people which globally know already about the computer and they just want to see other things. For example, they order the computer and they want to see uh, how uh, it will look with a case and what case to choose. This is from InCase uh, brand, which is here on the side and can be also ordered from Apple website. I just picked up this one because it was having good reviews. The video is not sponsored, but I'm happy with it. Maybe a little bit less happy with the color, which looks too dark to me. So when you open the uh, box, uh, you can see here that together with the computer that I will show you in a moment, in the box, you find the cable, you find some instructions which are here and contains basically some stickers, and the uh, user guide, which is uh, like a, a very uh, quick steps to understand what are the new features for this MacBook Pro. This model is the 2019 model, so it's the model from last year, but it's still the last on the market. And then you find some stickers and some additional instructions. So this could be a quick guide and it could be very useful uh, for people which uh, uh, want to get a quick start. The other things that you find, as I was saying, is the cable for the charger, which is still intact. And you also, for the MacBook Pro 16 inches, you have the, uh, uh, the power, so the charger, this is the big one. So you usually have about the, the 60 watt, 61 watt for the smaller one, and this is the 96, 96 watt, which is here, and it's a USB-C power adapter. So this is a bigger, for the 16 inches, while the smaller usually is for the 13 inches. Um, so let's have a look to uh, the laptop now. So as I was saying, the laptop, which is a beautiful machine, is already in the cover the way I installed it. And uh, the laptop is, by default, is meant to turn on when you uh, turn uh, when you uh, lift uh, uh, the lid. So here it is. When you lift the lid. It will appear this way so you can see that now the laptop is turning on and um, the first thing that you will see of course is my account is this beautiful screen this screen is a, a retina uh, screen so it's um, it's retina built so it's very very beautiful bright colors of course I have set up my account again I say that this video is not really taking everything from scratch uh, but uh, it, it does some hard on so you can watch this video and other videos as well about the mark and maybe you can find some useful information here so here we are once we lift up the lid we are quickly into the OS system of the Mac OS system, so a system of our machine. The machine is very beautiful, it's well built, it's all aluminum. It has this big uh, trackpad in the middle, which is very responsive, and you can actually regulate on the screen the speed of your uh, um, indicator, the cursor, and it's, it's really very nice, and you can select if you can 
a click by tapping or you can use two fingers tapping for the right click or you can just use the hidden buttons which are here for left click and right click this is a keyboard the keyboard can be also uh, it has some uh, light in case you want to use it uh, in the dark and this is the model with the touch bar so this is digital it means that you can get this beautiful screen which is a retina display and you can using the touch bar for example for the light or the volume you can control in a digital way the volume you can control also the the light um, you can see here on the screen actually this setting so far is automatic it means that your desktop with a, a new feature a feature that is for the new macbook pro is called true tone and so it will change according to the ambient light if it recognizes from the camera that is not visible here but is more or less here in the in the middle of the top part if you recognize that there's poor light it will enhance the brightness of the screen the screen as i said is a beautiful retina display very clear and even the desktop itself uh, this is dynamic so when you now it's morning here so you can see there's the sun it's a it's a small feature but it's not very nice if you use the computer in the evening the sky will be uh, uh, like it will be a different picture which uh, pictures uh, also the desktop as it will look if it's evening um, the laptop has two speakers on the side you can see here and here the sound from the speaker is uh, very beautiful and it looks uh, without uh, any noise we can test the audio on the computer so to do that I don't have any specific one I just went on YouTube page it looks for non copyrighted music so not to violate any copyright um, this is uh, from the touch bar where we can regulate the volume so we can put the volume at the maximum and we can do the same for YouTube yeah, you can see we are not even at the maximum it's gonna cover my voice so I have to speak a bit louder but the audio is so fantastic don't have any noise so you can you have listened to this it's very nice the audio and you have no noise as I was saying also uh, both the bass as well as the high pitch is well captured so in this Mac is absolutely amazing one thing I didn't say regarding the the uh, MacBook Pro is so the style I like it very much is very regular as you can see no special feature is uh, quite squared but I like it very much it keeps everything professional so what do we have here is the uh, Thunderbolt 3 connection to Thunderbolt 3 connection and then we have the uh, connection for the jack for the speaker the Thunderbolt 3 you know it's uh, a um, connection is the last connection the fastest connection that you can have so this is very nice to have and of course this you use not only if you want to transfer things with an adapter but also if you want to charge your 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 um, laptop you will use this otherwise you will need if you have for example if you want to connect a classic uh, USB-C port you need an adapter to uh, first enter into the Thunderbolt and then have an exit with the USB or the HDMI if you want to connect to another screen and so on. One thing I like so much about this computer is that it is very thin and uh, you can see here from the side for the screen or from the side uh, there uh, where near the keyboard. Um, no matter that, even if it's so thin, I have uh, tested also other computer. This computer is capable to handle very um, computational demanding tasks and not get warm at all. It get warm maximum 40 uh, Celsius degrees. So this is probably due to the material. It's probably due to the way it is built inside. There are two fans which regulate um, the, the the heat, um, so that the flux of heat uh, they push it outside. From the bottom of the computer, there are two uh, parts where the heat can go, and um, this is, as I was saying, this is very efficient. Now, I've ordered this computer with specific specs, which uh, include uh, 64 giga of RAM, um, a graphic card of uh, AMD Radeon 5500M, 
with uh, 8 giga um, 8 giga of RAM and then this machine is a beast this has 8 cores uh, Intel i9 uh, 2.4 gigahertz with turbo boss up to 5 gigahertz and the reason for that is that I work with this machine so much with simulations and very expensive tasks and again I must say for whoever wants to buy a machine which is thin and at the same time doesn't get warm not in the area where you use the trackpad not in the area where you use the keyboard and stay cool this is portable still somehow even if it's a bit big it's portable because it's thin and it's it keeps really everything on a, a acceptable temperature so um so far so good i think i showed you a few of the options now another thing i want to show you want to talk about is this bar down here this is a quick access to all the pre-installed application that you can find in the mac so you have uh, application for the photos application for the music of course you can connect to itunes if you have your iPhone or your iPad, you can synchronize the file between the, two, the different devices. You can transfer file very easily. You can put files on the cloud and then store there forever, as long as you do not remove it. One special um, feature I like so much is this one, which is a launchpad. And then you have, with the big icon, easy access to all the options, uh, all the applications which are built in. So all these, the way I'm showing you, I didn't modify any application even from the Apple TV and so on, this is exactly the application the way you see when you buy the computer. And then you have a bit of more application in the second page, including chess if you if you play so, and so on. So you have pretty of option of using your new computer. Also, uh, numbers is the equivalent of Excel, your calculator, text editor, and so on. You can always add additional application. You can always add even your your Microsoft Office if you want. You can even uh, think to partitionate the hard disk as I probably will do because I also need Windows. Um, you can also do this. Uh, the Mac has some built-in features for doing that in a very secure way and one is the bootcamp, but you will discover many of them. So as long as you go through the launch pad there or you go here on the Apple logo on top, then you have the system preferences and you can go through all the settings from the screen image, image, the mouse, the, uh, the, the account, and so on. You can do this for several different things. You have a search engine, and of course, this is, will be connected to your uh, special account. So there's my name in there, but uh, for every account, uh, you will have access to your file, and you will have access to the option of the computer. So um, that's um the first thing that i want to uh, tell you so i hope that you like the video um and uh we are always open to comments uh from the video and if you have any special question you can always ask us thank you very much for watching Prova, prova, suck, test, test glasses, test without glasses, test happy, Thank you. that's beautiful. <laughs> test sneeze, <laughs> test coughing, basta. Without glasses is bad. Yeah.